again. Uh, we're continuing our lectures on brain tumors for braincancer.org. We discussed the fact that temozolomide puts a side product on the guanine part of DNA, and this molecule will prevent the DNA strand from becoming synthesized. It'll cause a break in the DNA, and this will send the cell into a spiral of downward cellular death called apoptosis. So you can see that it's important for this chemo drug to get this molecule attached to that guanine. Some people have an enzyme in their tumor called MGMT. MGMT is a protein called methylguanine methyltransferase. So, if this enzyme is produced, it will come in, grab this molecule, yank it off of the guanine, and so the chemo will have no impact. So if you have functional methyl guanine methyltransferase, that's really a bad thing because that means your tumor cells are synthesizing or producing their own protein that can inactivate the chemotherapeutic drug. How does that translate into methylation and what does methylation mean? Well, this is going to entail a little bit more explanation because when we look at a gene in somebody, a gene is just a strand of DNA that has a promoter region and a business end, which is the part that makes or codes for protein, in this case MGMT. So there is a thing called DNA methylation that can inactivate a promoter region. So if someone has methylation of the promoter region of their MGMT gene, then that means this gene is going to be inactivated. So that will put a stop on this gene from being expressed. This will not go forward to make MGMT. So if you're methylated, you will not produce the MGMT protein. If you do not produce the MGMT protein, you will not be able to remove this molecule from the guanine. If you do not remove this molecule from the guanine, the chemotherapy will have a greater effect. So I know it's very complicated. However, patients that have MGMT methylation have a better prognosis because they don't make this enzyme in their tumor cells which can inactivate temozolomide. However, if you have unmethylated MGMT promoter region, this will cause activation of the gene, it will cause production of this MGMT protein. The MGMT protein will come up here and scavenge away the effects of temozolomide so that an unmethylated MGMT promoter will allow the protein MGMT to inactivate the chemo. Long-winded expla explanation, but it's a very important thing because there is a significant overall survival for patients who have methylation versus unmethylation of their MGMT promoter gene. Thank you.